All right, this is cabin 11202. And I believe this is what they call a junior balcony cabin. There's all the important emergency information right here. Are the lights? I've got to put my um, room card in there. Do that right now. Okay, slip that in there. All right, and the lights come on. Lights are on. Okay, so over right directly on the right hand side is the closet. Goes all the way down. And you open this side. So you would have plenty of closet space. And there's the safe. And you have drawers. One, two, three, four, five. Wait. One, two, three, four, five. I've got six drawers. <laughs> That's awesome. Five. Space all the way up. And here, that area there, is where the TV, it's a decent sized TV, it's not huge. And the mini bar. And this is the first time that it's been unlocked. This, <laughs> and I was impressed. And then inside, it is stocked. And I know that everything here Whatever you get, it's gonna cost a fee. I'm gonna look at the prices because I have some onboard credit, so might just use it for that. Then you have this huge, that's a mirror right there. Hi. It's just a huge mirror. It just almost takes up the whole room. And have a full bed. And I'm traveling solo, so it's going to stay like that. I'm going to have a nice big bed. And a little desk area over here. Which is nice. Got drawers. There's a hair dryer there. And that one doesn't open there. And then the nightstand here. And we've got drawers here. Yeah, they're not real smooth. It tells the older ship. All right. Not sure what that is for. Lights here. And I don't see any USB ports around there. Not that they're, I don't see any. I like the decor. This red color, it, it's, it, it's okay. It's not my favorite, but <laughs> it's okay. Another nightstand and another phone over there, which is good. Let's see what we have as far as outlets. I think it's the outlet. Oh, okay. So I'm going to have two, two outlets there. And then we've got lighted mirror. So that just lit up. It's really nice. And then you have an ottoman that comes out for you to sit on. Right there. Okay, and then we'll go to the bathroom. Okay. So you've got two hooks up there for hanging towels and whatnot. Shower. The um, this is this is adjustable. I hope because I am not that short. <laughs> I'm short, but I'm not that short. Oh, I'm sure I could raise that up. Must have had a little one in here taking a shower right before. Towels right there. Throne. Then I have storage here. Nice shelving, nice little 
bathroom glasses, sink is angled. I feel like I have a good amount of room in this in this restroom. And there's more storage down there. And trash can there. And Kleenex right here. Sometimes people don't know where the Kleenex is. They said that they don't supply. Well, maybe that's not the Kleenex. Oh, yes, it is. It's just a new box. All right. And my most important, well, almost most important. Now, there's a little chair here with a little table. I love that. I love that. Okay. And here is the balcony. So I've got two chairs. And then there's a table right in between. All right. Here is Miami. Downtown Miami right there. And that is the room tour for cabin 11202 on the MSC Magnifica. I am traveling out of Miami and we'll be going to Freeport, Bahamas, and Nassau, Bahamas. Four day cruise, leaving on Monday, coming back on Friday. All right. This is Carol with Solo Cruising and more. Like and subscribe. Oh, I also wanted to mention I originally booked an Ocean View cabin. I received an email to bid for an upgrade and it was accepted about a week before I cruised. I was very pleased with the location of my cabin. The decks above and below my deck were all cabins. I opted for the Fantastica experience, which includes a continental breakfast room service. You fill out the card, you hang it on your door before 2 a.m. and you specify a delivery time and uh, you have your coffee, juice, whatever it is that you order, you have that uh, in the morning in your room. It was wonderful. 